There's been another shocking twist in the murder case that inspired the hit podcast Serial nearly a decade ago. Adnan Syed was sentenced 23 years ago to life in prison for the killing of his ex-girlfriend. He was freed last year after the podcast raised doubts about the case against him. Now, an appeals court has effectively restored his conviction. The judges ruled yesterday that there should be a new hearing on the motion to vacate, which would land Syed back in court. Our national correspondent, Jerika Duncan, has more. Adnan Syed spent 22 years, more than half of his life, behind bars for the murder of his former high school girlfriend, Hey Min Lee. For years, he proclaimed his innocence, most notably during phone calls from prison recorded for the 2014 podcast, Serial. Whatever the motivation is to kill someone, I had absolutely, it didn't exist in me. He finally walked free this past September after a hearing where his murder conviction and life sentence were vacated. But the victim's family says they were blindsided by that hearing, only having time to participate via Zoom. They were told that the state did not have confidence in the conviction and therefore moved to vacate the conviction with one day's notice to the family. There was no transparency with respect to the new evidence that the state claims to have. On Tuesday, the appellate court of Maryland agreed that the short notice violated the state's victims' rights laws and ordered a new hearing. That in turn reinstated Syed's murder conviction. The ruling has been stayed for 60 days while both sides consider their next steps. All we're talking about here is whether or not the trial court complied with Maryland law. None of this means that he's going back to jail in the short or long term. Syed's legal team plans to appeal the reinstated conviction to the state Supreme Court. Syed himself is said to be taking the news in stride. Adnan has a life outside of prison now. He works, he visits his family, he takes care of his sick parents, and he's going to continue to do that. He's going to continue to live his life. Lee's family hopes this new hearing will show them why Syed's conviction was vacated and perhaps lead to some closure. For the first time, we and the world will get an opportunity to see that evidence and examine that evidence. If Adnan Saeed is in fact innocent, we would want to know that as much as anyone else. Now, if there is a new hearing, the victim's family will be able to, again, see what evidence the state used to vacate Saeed's conviction. The family's attorney says they also will be ready to fight for their right to challenge the evidence presented. Guess we'll have to wait and see what happens, Jerika. Thank you so much.